Okay, everyone, so we're back with part two of Undertale. Uh, I am still incredibly regretful of what happened last time. Um, I told the Keekster what transpired in the last part, and she was so baffled that she had to laugh. <laughs> So we're just gonna- we're just gonna jump right into it, you know? <laughs> uh, who is this? That dog considers itself an artist, but doesn't ever know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. Damn, you just over here trying to be negative? Oh, okay. Wait, how do I do this? Uh- Sans? It's a lump of snow with the word Sans written on it in red marker. It's a snow papyrus. Wait, why? <laughs> why is that down here? Okay, we have to go directly. We have to go. Oh, we have to actually turn them all to zeros. Oh, shoot. Okay, wait. Now they're trying to pull out the big guns on us. Okay, I got it. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> ah, I got it. I'm a genius. Am I a genius? No, I got it. Oh, I don't got it. Oh, I got it. Wait, I'm actually a genius. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, we're, we're going. What is over here? Wolf. Fair enough. <laughs> Just wolf. Oh, we can leave. Oh. Hello? Wait, are they all dogs? <gasps> nah. <laughs> It's the greater dog. What is this clown music? Look at his spear. Oh. Oh. Ah! 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 <laughs> greater dog is watching you intently. Get him. Get him. Oh, oh shit. Oh, what am I supposed to do about that? Greater dog is waiting for your command. Get him. Okay. So, we've determined, we've determined, since I already know this about Undertale, but I shouldn't, we've determined that this is a genocide run at this point, so we kill. <laughs> we kill them. Okay, wait, what is past here? I don't want to go too far, though. Oh, that looks like a point of no return. Wait, let me go down first. See what was down there first. All right. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, oh, there's things looking at me. What is that? A gift trot confronts you? Get him! Ooh, get this off of me. Wait, what is on you? Ah! Ah! <laughs> gift trot tries vainly to remove its decorations. Nah, you don't get it. We're killing ya. You can't be happy. Is this funny to you? <laughs> okay. Gift Trot's antlers tremble. Well, goodbye. <laughs> you won. You earned 35 experience and 30 gold. Dang, they're giving a lot of money now. What is this? Is it like a wizard? It's a door. Yeah, I can see that. Huh? Huh? It's a door. Is there like a pattern that I have to do? Okay, process of elimination. It's a door. Uh, just this one. It's a door. Okay, um... These two. Nope. Uh... Just this. 
Dang it. Okay, this. Okay, clearly I'm missing something here. It's like the code on this screen. There's like grass on the floor. Nah, I don't know what it is. <laughs> maybe I have to come back. Or maybe I'm a bozo. Both possible. Did Toby Fox like play his own? Does he play the piano? Is he the. Did he make all the music for this game? Because it is kind of a banger. I know Megalovania. I know that song. Da -ba -da 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 that one. I know it because of Lily Pichu. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Human. This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. <gasps> Not the dog. When I say the word, it'll fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the holdup? Holdup? What holdup? I'm I'm about to activate it now. That uh doesn't look very activated. Okay, I don't know if anyone's gonna get this, but there's a game from the DS called Touch Detective, and Sans sounds like the characters from that game. Um, but I don't know if anyone's gonna get that. <laughs> well, this challenge. It seems maybe too easy to be to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are my puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. He doesn't want to kill us. Phew. He likes us. What are you looking at? This is another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Heh. That's heh? <laughs> he likes us. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Blue attacks? Oh shoot, I don't remember what he told me about that last time. Did he say not to move if there's blue attacks? Oh shoot. My memory is like a like a goldfish. Welcome to Snowden. Ooh, we can save already. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Save. Oh, I can put stuff away. Okay, wait, let's go into the shop. <gasps> Super cool! Hello, traveler. How can I help you? Let's buy. Weapon. Five attack? Oh, five attack. Slap him. Wait, I can just have a weapon? Armor. Seven defense. It has abs on it. Bicycle? Bicycle. Heals 11 HP times 2, eat it twice. Oh, I see. Heals 22 HP, it's my own recipe. How about... How about a weapon? Oh shoot, how much... Okay. And then a manly bandana? Okay. Exit. Uh, talk. Uh, say hello. Hiya, welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? Capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? Uh, what to do here? You want to know what to do here in Snowden? Groby's has food and the library has information. Ooh, it's like a whole town. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. <laughs> There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and... asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Oh, okay, that's good. Town history. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up count and... Count? Set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages. Wait, weren't we just there? We were just there. So unless you're a ghost and can bury it under the door, forget about it. We were... The ruins is where we started, right? 
your life? Life is the same as usual. A little class, class, <laughs> a little claustrophobic. But we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? All right, let's leave. Bye now, come again sometime. Okay, so if I bought armor, I think, how do I open my inventory? Okay, uh, item. Okay, tough glove. Use? You equip tough glove. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Okay, wait, let me equip my manly bandana. Use, you equipped a manly bandana. Let's go. Let's save to that. Cheers to that. All right, let's go to the inn. Oh, this is a sister? Ooh, what is that? Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. Oh! What's maximum HP? <laughs> Welcome to Snowed Inn. Oh, Snowed Inn. Snowden's premier hotel. One night is 80... 80... I was gonna say grams. Stay. Here's your room key. Make sure to bundle up. There's a whole family sleeping next to me. Is that the inn's family? Baby Snorin. Hiya, you look like you had a great sleep. Which is incredible because you were only up there for about two minutes. <laughs> Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. Oh. Oh. Was I not supposed to click when I was up there? Oh, look at this teepee. Oh. <gasps> This is a huge town. Let's go back. I guess they're actually gonna spend some time in this town if they have a TP like that. Don't want to walk to the other side of town? Try the under snow tunnels. They're efficiently laid out. Okay. That lady over there seems happy today. Don't know why, but it's sending shivers down my spine. Ah, it's so peaceful and quiet. Usually one of those dogs chases my little cinnamon around. Oh, true. You know what's cute? Me. <laughs> Those two married dogs always put presents under the tree for each other. It's always the same. A single bone. But every time, they act like it's the first time they've gotten it. Then Papyrus comes to take his bones back. <laughs> anyway, where are those two? Yeah, where are the dogs? What dogs do we speak of? Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Wait, this looks like... What Pokemon is that? Scraggy? Is it Scraggy? <laughs> this town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. All right, let's go to grill bees. Ooh, okay. It's so, 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 so quiet in here. L lighten up, everybody. This is why I hate this, this place. What is this? Hmm, isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. <laughs> the capital's great. Oh, the capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Who knows? Maybe we'll have room. Is this Calcifer? No, it's the guy from Boku no Hero. What is his name? Ooh, I don't remember. Dots, dots, dots. Grilbs, Grilbs, Grilbs said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. I forget the name of the guy from Boku no Hero. Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard. The... Huh? Where are they? Something feels really off. <gasps> Wait, did I kill one of the dogs? Oh, I killed one of the dogs, didn't I? <gasps> no, I put, I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. Fair enough. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. Oh, true. True and real. Who is this? It just feels like, like everything is getting worse and worse. Fair enough. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose, morose about it? I'm 
mean, fair enough. I could take a page out of that book. <laughs> Live Barbie. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. <laughs> that look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? How'd you know? I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. <laughs> well, you're gonna have to fill it with the fact that I killed your royal guard dog. I'm so sorry. Cough, cough. When I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time, but look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Pop off, sis. Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of. But the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. Fair enough. Monster History Part 4. Fearing the humans no longer, we moved out of our old city, home. We braved harsh, cold, damp swampland and searching, oh, searing heat until we reached what we now call our capital. New home! True. Again, our king is really bad at names. <laughs> Maybe I should start from this, this one. It's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool as heck. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on that person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kind of sick of writing this. <laughs> While monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. True. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us but they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. A bullet pattern? What? Here I am, writing this book. A person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry. I'm still writing that one. <laughs> because they are made of magic, monstrous bodies are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. I'm cruel. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill... Um, let's end the chapter here. <laughs> I have a powerful soul. Let's keep going. Is that a person? What is this? Oh, it's a mailbox. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. This mailbox is labeled papyrus! Look inside, yeah. It's empty. Oh, so the left one is probably Sansa's mailbox. That's funny. Okay, let's go into their house. Is that... Oh, it's locked. Oh, she. It's locked from the inside. Ooh. Honestly, I'm presently surprised with this game so far because I literally thought it was like a mostly black and like a black colored game. Why is it getting like kind of creepy over here? Oh. Oh. <gasps> Are we entering Silent Hill? Human. Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another's puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you're cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the great papyrus, will be your... Dot, dot, dot. No. No. This is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. Oh, I killed one of the Royal Guards. I'm so sorry. <gasps> We're fighting him. What did Sam say about blue attacks? <laughs> Papyrus blocks away. Fight him! Press Z! So you won't fight. Wait, why? Then let's see if you can handle my favorite fabled blue attack. 
I think he said not to move. Yeah. Get, get wrecked. Can you imagine if you don't remember what San says and you just get attacked like hella dirt right there? <gasps> Rude. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> what? You're blue now? What does that mean? Punch him! Behold! I can jump. I've played Flappy Bird before. I've played a little bit of Flappy Bird. Pyrus is trying hard to play it cool. Get him! Get him! How high can you jump? Higher than you could ever imagine. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Pyrus is cackling. Get him! Hold up longer to jump higher. Jeez. Okay, you have to be like perfect about it. Like no over jumping, you know what I mean? Pyrus is trying hard to play it cool. Get him! I'm better. Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Oh shoot. Oh shoot! Papyrus prepares a non-bone attack, then spends a minute fixing his mistake? <laughs> Get him! I can almost taste my future popularity! Wait, 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 I forgot how to play this game. Okay. <gasps> That's cheating! Papyrus is trying hard to play it cool. Papyrus, head of the royal guard. Bro, this is cheating. <laughs> Papyrus whip whispers. <laughs> Get him! I might lose this. <laughs> Papyrus, unparalleled sp spaghettor. Are you kidding me? Ah. Please. Papyrus is considering his options. I might lose. Undyne will be really proud of me. Bruh. How am I supposed to get through this? What? Papyrus is rattling his bones. Okay. The king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile. Okay, we're surviving. We lose here. My brother will, well, he won't change very much. No! You're too weak. I was easily able to capture you. I will now send you to the capture zone. Or, as Sans calls it, our garage. <laughs> You're in the doghouse now. <laughs> Ooh, was I supposed to lose that? Probably not, but you know. It's a note from Papyrus. Sorry, I have to lock you in the guest room until Undyne arrives. Feel free to make yourself at home. Refreshments and accommodations have been provided. Definitely yours, Papyrus. Thank you, Bestie. Unfortunately, it's just dry food. Unfortunately, I'm not a dog. It's too small to sleep on. Well, I can just walk through the bars. <laughs> Oh boy. It's locked. Okay, let's go like heal or something. Say. Okay, so let's go up. We didn't ever go up. Oh, there's more stuff up here. What is this? A rock with a mustache? Oh my gosh. I've sent the kids inside. It feels unsafe here today. Where are you? Ah, what a beautiful knock. <gasps> Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, oh, my patient rewards me. Ah. Ah, okay, never mind. What is this? A snow. Holy moly. Jeez. Oh, he's throwing those into the water? But why? Okay. Okay, bestie, pop off, I guess. 
Wait, what is up here? Why is this like this? Oh, okay. Not sure what that's for. The pop-off? Okay, I'm gonna try to go back to where Papyrus was and see if he's still there. I'm guessing he's not. Can I still go in here? Oh, it's locked from the inside. I actually cannot go in there. So let's keep walking and see if Papyrus stops us again. Unless we can go up here. Can I go on that? Nope, okay. Is it Papyrus again? Oh, it is. So we actually have to beat him. I understand. Oh, where could that human have gone? Wait, it's right in front of me. Hello, I was worried that you'd gotten lost. It sure is a relief to know that you're right there. Wait a second. You're not supposed to escape. Get back there. Okay. Papyrus blocks the way. Okay, now I understand that I have to hit Z though, so I might be able to beat him. Get him! Behold, my special attack. What? What the heck? That's my special attack. Hey, you stupid dog. Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. Hey, what are you go doing? Come back here with my special attack. Where is it? Thoughts. Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Ow! Ow! Well, you may have cleverly escaped from jail before, but this time I've upgraded the facilities. Not only will you be trapped, but you won't even want to leave. Yeah, heh heh heh. Oh man. What? It's the same. It's a note from Papyrus. Please ask before you escape. When you went missing, I got worried sick. Slightly bone trouseled? Papyrus, this is the same facility. There's a hot dog cut up into the kibble. Okay, wait, hold on. It's too small, okay. Well, I mean, he's he's enticing me with that hot dog. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna try again. <laughs> I'm gonna try again. We'll see what happens with Papyrus this time. I mean, I'm glad that I got to see that he puts a hot dog for me. That's very kind of him. Very kind. Hello, Papyrus. Back again, eh? I suppose it's my fault. I told you before that I would make you spaghetti. It's only natural that you would want to see me. In the dire hope that I would make you some? Well, I understand. Papyrus is hungry too. Hungry for justice. Da -da 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 -da. Get out of here. Sigh, here's an absolutely normal attack. Are you- <laughs> Wait, stop! Are you kidding me? Cool? Dude? With a skateboard? Okay... Ain't no way he just pulled that on me. What is this attack? Huh? Well, Huff, it's clear. You can't, Huff, defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore I, the great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Ooh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the mercy because I feel like he'll make our, our time interesting. And I feel like it would make Sans sad if we killed him. Yo ho ho, I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard. And my friend quantity will reign stagnant. What should you say? Let's be friends? What a loot. Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wow, I have friends. And who knew that all I needed to make them was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. 
I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like you. That's why the king await- Wait, what? The king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you'll have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is, well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a, a cool friend. <laughs> Feel free to come by and hang out. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's going... Oh, how are you doing that? <laughs> how do you do that? Okay, I know that a lot of people like Sans. But like, where, 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 are, the, where are the papyrus lovers? Because I'm kind of digging the dude. I think he's cool. <laughs> okay, I'm going to save. So that I can heal. Then we'll go talk to Papyrus since he's standing outside of his house. Hello, dude. So you came back to see me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Oh, oh, we're popping off. Look how fast we're walking. Wait, where are we going? Oh, why are we about facing right now? What was that sequence? My house. Bestie. What is happening in the room upstairs? It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. Wait, where is Sans? This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take the responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. <laughs> Wait, why is he like the best character? Tell me why. My brother always goes out to eat, but... Recently, he tried baking something. It was like a quiche. Oh, I like quiches. But filled with a sugary, non-egg substance? How absurd. True. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. Oh, look at its eyes. <laughs> what? Catch that meddling canine. Get him. Wait, I, my back is itchy. My back. My back. My back is itchy. Curses. He's such a memer. Sans, stop plaguing my life with incidental music. Can I look in your fridge? Aha! Uh -huh. Interested in my feud, feud? Food museum? Please peruse my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips in the fridge. Wait, my back. Guys, my back is itchy. Guys, I can't reach it. It's like at the part of my back that I can't reach. Oh no. Oh, okay. We have to ignore it. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit it any time. Okay, thanks, bestie. Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. That's so relatable. You touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20 gold? Let's go. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Yeah. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. 
Welcome to Scenic My House. Wait, what? Scenic My House? Welcome to Scenic My, my Back. My Back. Oh, it's a whole saga. It's a soul saga, my back! Ugh. Enjoy and take your time. That's my room. If you finish looking around, we could go in and hang out like a pair of very cool friends. Uh, no. Let me go to Sans' room first. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. Bones. <laughs> The door is locked. Okay, well, we don't know what he's doing in there. Okay, let's go in. What what does cool 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 friends do? Go inside? Yes. <gasps> he does have a cool room. <laughs> so, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start hanging out? Oh, no, 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 no. Take your time. I'll wait for you. Let's look at everything. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it basically just happened. <laughs> Look at this bed. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wi wind? Wind in my hair. Sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead I cruise while I snooze. True. Ah, yes, action figures. A great reference for the theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. A chubbing, chubby, smiling man? Yeah, that's right. Santa, oh true. Isn't that flag Nito? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world? Now I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Oh, true, we descended from skeletons. <laughs> that book's one of my favorites. Advanced Puzzle Construction for Critical Minds. That next book's another one's of my favorite. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. True. There are no skeletons inside my closet, except me sometimes. <laughs> yes. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Oh, true, he's just responsible. The internet. I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. Let's freaking go. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. The computer's internet browser is open to a social media site. Okay, let's talk to him. Let's hang out. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start hanging out? Yeah, let's hang out. Okay, let's hang that. Hang 10? Let's hang 10. Wait, we're fighting? Hang out, start. Here we are. Why does this just sound like... This just sounds like Ace Attorney. You can't tell me this is an Ace Attorney. I've actually never done this before, but don't worry. You can you can't spell prepared without several letters for my name. I snagged an official hangout guidebook from the library. This sounds so much like Ace Attorney. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one, press the C key on your friend. On your friendship hood? On your keyboard for a friendship hood. Wowee, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Step two, ask them to hang out. Ahem. Human, I, the great papyrus, will hang out with you. Yes. Oh my god, really? Wowee. I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Thoughts. Wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that. Earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? <laughs> Look at him blushing. <laughs> you wanted to hang out with me from the very beginning? Yes. No! 
You planned it all. You're way better at hanging out than I am. No, your friendship power. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Don't think you've bested me yet. I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at hanging out, and I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I, too, can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case someone wants to hang out. Behold. <gasps> He's a cool dude! Yeah, what do you think of my secret style? I love it. No! A genuine compliment! <laughs> However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This hangout won't escalate any further. Unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Move and expect with Z. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. How about your boxers? Okay. How about your basketball shoulders? I see, I see. You like caressing my biceps with a floating heart. But who doesn't? Uh, cool dude. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. How about your hat? My hat? My hat. My hat! Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. Open it. What is that? Is that spaghetti? Do you know what this is? Of course. Spaghetti. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right. But oh, so wrong. This ain't any pl bleh, 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 bleh. This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silken spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. Eat it. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me, oh, oh, true. Maybe even more than I do. Ugh. Erg. No! <gasps> oh, it's going crazy. Human, it's clear now. You're completely obsessed with me. Oh my god, you're obsessed with me. Everything you do, everything you say. It's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you, I, Papyrus. Huh. Well, I'm flattered you care so much. But maybe cool it a little bit. You are a very nice person. I'm glad we're friends. But I think you can reach your max potential. If you live more for your own sake, rather than just mine. Oh, thank you. You're so kind. Huh. Hey, I know the solution. You should hang out with my boss, Undyne. I think if you spread your friend energy out more, you'll have a more healthy lifestyle. Yeah, let's be friends with Undyne. <laughs> Excuse me? I thought Undyne wanted my booty. Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. Oh, let's go. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Does he think that I have a crush? I don't have a crush on you. Well, gotta go. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, bestie. Are you in the closet? Yes. Clothes are hung up neatly. Okay, never mind. I thought he would be hiding in the closet. <laughs> Can we talk to Sans, please? The door is locked. Okay, fine. Is he in here? No. Okay, let's leave. Okay, so... What do I do now? Do I go try to go this way again? Have we figured out the code for the door yet? No. Let's just keep going and see what happens. Oh, it just clears up. I see. What is this water? What is this on the floor? Are they crystals? Oh, I think they're crystals, actually. Oh, there's 
Sans. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome, she's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. Haha, <laughs> true. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. True. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Save. Hello, Sans. What? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I'm gonna grill bees. Wanna come? Yeah, let's go, go to grill bees. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Over here. I know a shortcut. What? Where? Huh! Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone. Greetings, Sans. Hiya, Sansy. Hey, Sans, weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? <laughs> Nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. <laughs> but Here, get comfy. Whoops, watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What'd you want? A burger. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Grillby, we'll have a double order of burg. Give me that burg. Is he combing his hair? So what do you think of my brother? He's cool, I like him. Of course he's cool. He'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. <laughs> He'd only take that off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. Oh, he's like so responsible. He's a responsible king. And by that, I mean he wears it in the shower. Fair enough. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Yeah! Bon appetit! True. You tip the ketchup. The cap falls off and all the ketchup in the bottle pours onto your food. Whoops. Eh, forget about it. You can have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. He's gonna eat it. He's gonna eat it. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries real hard. Like how he keeps trying to be part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. <laughs> but the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's uh, still a work in progress. True. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Uh, yes. So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them, and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Pyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? I'm getting goosebumps. Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. That was weird. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from my work from that long. For blah 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 blah. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? <laughs> it's just. No! Just kidding. Grilby, put it on my tab. 10,000 gold? Was that 100,000? By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. Oh, true. What? <laughs> I hate that. I hate it so much. Okay. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> Let's talk to this. All that gives my life validation ex is explaining the echo flower. No one can know. Oh, that's awkward. All right, Sans, what you got for me, buddy? Let's hang out again sometime, true bestie. What are these rocks? What are these olivine CEOs? This is a box. You can put an item in or take an item out. Oh, why would you though? You can't use items when they're in the box, true? Sincerely, oh, a box hater this time. 
Oh, I can just walk through? Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. What is over here? Can I walk this way? Okay, no. Walk this way! Oh, there's one over here! I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Behind it? Huh? There's a camera behind the waterfall. A camera? For why? For how and why? Wait, can I talk to the flower again? Maybe he has something else to say. Oh no, okay. So why is there a camera? Why is that? Is that the technology we have? I guess we have refrigerators. Okay. Ooh, why is that creepy? Why is there a shadow? Ooh, blah, blah, blah. Hey, can I look at this waterfall? Oh, shoot! <gasps> what is this? There's a tutu lying on the ground here. Will you take it? Yeah, let's take it. You got the old tutu. Wait, what are these? Oh, no. They're all connected, aren't they? Oh, no. Turn them off. I wonder if, like, that wizard door is like an end game thing and you have to like turn off certain ones throughout the whole map to open it uh don't tell me though no spoilies no spoilies okay let's look at this tutu old tutu info old tutu armor defense 10 finally a protective piece of armor oh we'll do the tutu then let's use it you equip the old tutu does that mean that we're not using the other thing? Oh yeah, okay, so we're not using the manly bandana anymore. Info. Manly bandana armor defense 7. It has so seen somewhere. It has dropped. I can't read. I don't like the shadow. Ooh. Hi, Undyne. I'm here with my daily report. Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? Uh, yes, of course I did. I fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? Oh, well, no. I tried very hard, Undyne, but in the end, I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But Undyne, you don't ha have to destroy them. You see? You see? Oh. Dots. I understand. I'll help you in a, any way I can. Oh, this poor guy. We're supposed to be besties. Oh, no. Get me out of here. Oh, get me out of here. No, I'm not here. You don't see anything. You don't hear anything? Why is this Ed from Full Metal Alchemist? <laughs> He just disappears like that? Okay. Oh, Scraggy. Yo, did you see the way she stared at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. What'd you do to get her your... What did you do to get her attention? Uh-huh. Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. Um, I think she wants to beat up me. Careful of your face. A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. Save. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. Okay. Let's just take these bridge seeds. This game has a lot more than I thought it did. Let's go. That was an interesting puzzle for sure. Oh my gosh! Aaron flexes in! Aaron Cybertron Zang! No need for a swimming suit, winky face. Wah! 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 <laughs> Aaron is sweating bullets. Get him! Bye, Aaron Cybertron Zang! Your love increased. 
Uh, let me go save. Oh, it's kind of far. Never mind. I was gonna save again, but it's okay. I can't reach that sign. Hello? What's that sign for? Oh no, there's more of these? No. Oh, I can take these. I see. Wait, but it has to be four aligned with each other? Wait, how will I do that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> um, I think I messed up. Um, he thinks I messed up. If an error is made, the Bell Blossom can call bridge seats back to where they started. Yeah, let's, let's do that. Okay. We need four lined up together. Will four fit here? Is it three? Oh, it's three. How do we... We need four lined up? Four of them. Because this won't work. Yeah, let's ring the bell. How are we gonna do that? Oh, unless we do four this way. Like right here. I think we can do this, actually. Let's do this. I see, so the earlier puzzle was just like a tutorial of how to use these seeds. So I was like, that's kind of easy, it's pretty obvious. There we go. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number se sequentially until I got yours. Yeah. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a dusty tutu. Is that true? Are you wearing a dusty tutu? What will you say? No. So you aren't wearing a dusty tutu. Got it. You're my friend, so I trust you a hundred percent. Have a nice day. I wonder if because he's my friend, he's gonna say that I am wearing a dusty tutu to save my butt and I just said I'm not wearing a dusty tutu. <gasps> I hope he doesn't do that. <laughs> a long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now, all we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. Wishing room. Oh. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Mm. What is this? Washua? Washua shuffles up? Is that duck in there? Wash you teeth and eyes. Oh, true. Oh, shoot. Washua, chill. Washua, chill. Ah, Washua, chill. Washua's revolted at his own wounds. Oh, shoot. Scrub a dub dubs. Tweet. Tweet. Oh, shoot. Oh, are you kidding me? Mercy. Spare. You won. You earned 0 XP and 21 gold. I should have killed Washua for real, for real. Come on, sis. Make a wish. I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. <gasps> Cute. Look through the telescope? Yeah. Wait, is there something to be unpacked there? Yes. Am I supposed to, like, get something from this? Ooh, I don't know. I don't know if I am. We'll see. Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. True. <gasps> Scared me. What is over here? What is this? Where am I? Ancient writing covers the walls. You can just make out the words. 
The War of Humans and Monsters. Okay. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside the human body even after death. Okay. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Can I see it? Oh shoot, where are we going? We're going on a trip! Oh, this shadow effect, some something about it makes me feel really strange. Oh no. 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 Bestie. Ow, 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 ow. Stop, 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 stop. Please. Bestie. Bestie. Bestie, we can chill about it. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. No, no, no. Ain't no way they did that to me. Ain't no way they... Oh no! I was a child! Yo, I'm actually heartbroken. You guys don't even know. I'm heartbroken! That's so... Not me, like, killing everything in my path, and that makes me so sad. That makes me so sad, but maybe that's what it wanted. <gasps> Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. Oh my gosh. You debated me so hard. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky? If you were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. I'm so glad you're alive, Bessie. That's all that matters. Oh my gosh, I just went through like a roller coaster of emotions. This cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It stuck to the table. <laughs> Squeak. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical cr crystal, it fills you with determination. Oh, there's Sans. Hello, bestie. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 50,000 gold to use this premium telescope, but since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Use the telescope? Yes. Oh, I can move my scope. Oh. Wait, could I have done that at the other telescope? Wait. What is on my face? Why do I have like an eye patch? Oh wait, now it's gone. Wait, what? Huh? Okay, I'm gonna go back to the other telescope. Oh, what is this? What are you? Three gold for the fairy. Yes, hop on. Wait, where are we going? <gasps> Bestie, I need to breathe. Thanks for stepping on my face. Here's the three gold. You got three gold? Wait, what? Wait, it's three gold because they want to be stepped on. That's amazing. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, let's look at this telescope real quick. Look through the telescope? Yes. 
So I can move. Oh. Check wall? Oh, but I already did that. I did that already. Oh, so this didn't really matter then. Okay. All right. What are you? What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? Excuse me? <laughs> oh my gosh, she's here again. I relocated my store, but there's still no customers. Fortunately, I thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for an, a, a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. Ice cream, it's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 25 gold. No, I don't have room. Well then, tell your friends. There's an ice cream hidden in the depths of a watery cavern. <laughs> the ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. Okay. So there's these mushroom things, right? I'm wondering if you just have to turn them all off. I'm wondering if, like, they put berries and stuff in the game because you're supposed to turn them off, you know? We'll see. Do not- do, no spoilies. <laughs> no spoilies. Okay, wait. Okay, let's go down here, I guess. Oh, there's a flower down here. You hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? What? You hear a passing conversation. Huh, just one, but it's kind of stupid. No wishes, stupid bestie. You walk into Mold Small. Oh, they don't even want to fight. They don't want to fight. Go back. Is there any way for me to go back? Oh, I did go back somehow. Wait, how did I go back? Spare. You won. You earned zero XP and zero gold. Wait, there was a way that I went back. I didn't know you could go back. Turn them all off. Turn them all off. There's something in that, isn't there? What's in here? Or is it just me rattling it around? Okay. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know. Her opinion of you is very... murdery. <laughs> Well, worry not, dear- Oh, he did it. He did what I said he did. Papyrus would never betray you. You said you were not wearing a dusty tutu. So of course I actually told her you were indeed wearing a dusty tutu. It pained me so much to tell such a bold-faced lie. But since you aren't wearing a dusty tutu, she surely won't attack you. Now you are safe and sound. Wowee, this is hard. I just want to be everybody's friend click oh okay you know what let's see what happens if we put on the manly banana instead what are you gonna do about now what are you gonna do about that now undyne it's washua fight him out darn spot firm 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 ow ow out washua please washua Washua is revolted at his own wounds. Mercy. Bye, Washua. Where are we at, though? You hear a passing conversation? Don't say that. Come on. I promise I won't laugh. Ooh, it's gonna be bad. It's gonna be bad. What is this? The power to take their souls. This is the power that the humans feared. True. I guide souls, does that count? Okay. Is there something more over here? Like, how do I get over there? Can I not get over there? Or maybe I have to walk around? Okay, let's go up here then. Washua! Washua, what are you doing, bestie? Scrub a dub dubs. Washua, you kind of scare me, not gonna lie. Washua! Washua! Stop! Why is Washua actually so difficult? No Washua left. 
You won. You earned 52 experience and 25 full. Ew. What is that? Uh, is that a Kraken? It's a Tamagotchi. Hey there, noticed you were here. I'm Onion-san. <laughs> Onion-san, you hear? Okay. You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Okay, Onion-san. I'm gonna just... Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time, but... Hey, that's okay. It's... It beats moving into the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. Hey, okay. hey, okay, Onion-san. And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though. Uh, you hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Alright, Onion-san. Hey there, that's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In Waterfall. Thanks, Onion-san. Kinda creepy, Onion-san. It scared me. Shiren? Shiren? Hides in the corner but somehow encounters you anyway? Oh. Oh, so I have to click shift to go back. Thoughts. Toot. True. Toot like a fart. Chiron's voice gets raspy. Okay, we will we will mercy you. You won. You earned zero XP and 20 gold. Maybe I should kill them for experience? Do I get stronger when I level? The northern room hides a great treasure. Well, I'm gonna go to the northern room then. X is to quit. Left, okay. There's a piano here, play it. Yes. What? Okay, wait. What is this? A haunting sound echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. What? Only the first eight are fine? Okay, I don't know what song they want me to play here. Am I supposed to know? This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And an incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monsters called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death. If only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened. And now it never will. What is that? It's a statue. Structures at its feet seem dry. The structures at its feet seem dry? Interesting. Please take one. Take an umbrella? Yes. He took an umbrella. What does this do for me? Do I have to cover him from the rain? Put the umbrella on the statue? Yeah. You place the umbrella atop the statue. Inside the statue, a music box begins to play. The music continues and doesn't stop. Oh, right there! Oh, okay. Dot up right. Dot down down right. Dot up right. Dot, 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 upright, dot, down, down, right. Okay. Dot, upright, dot, down, down, right. Dot, upright, dot, down, down, right. Okay. Yes. Dot, up, right, dot, down, down, right. Oh, <gasps> let's go.
Let's go. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Yeah. You're carrying too much. Oh, shoot. Dang it. Hold on. I'll be back. Oh, there's Onion Son again. Did you hear? You're back. I'll tell you a big secret. I'm starting a band, you hear? It's called the Red Hot Chibi Peppers. <laughs> All I've thought of is the name. And I don't play instruments or sing. Well, do you think we'll be popular? Yeah. Yeah, me too. Okay, Onion San, please leave me alone. Onion San, please leave me alone. Please leave me alone. I'm begging you to leave me alone. Okay. Let's just put the stick away. I have to remember to put the snowman somewhere. Also, I realized that I didn't go to the right. There's a duck. How do I get to the duck? It's a duck. <laughs> please, Onion San, please don't talk to me. Please don't. No. Oh, did you hear? Thoughts. I got nothing else to talk about. Okay, thank you. I'm going. Please leave me alone. <laughs> Please leave me alone. Okay. Alright, let's go get this artifact now. I half expected it to be gone. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Take it. You're carrying too many dogs? What are you- Huh? What do you mean too many dogs? Annoying dog. A little white dog? It's fat- Am I getting debated right now? What do you mean I'm carrying too many dogs? <laughs> what do you mean I'm carrying too many dogs? I'm just gonna go ahead. Hi, Scraggy. Yo, you can't hold it in brother eye. If you're walking away, I guess I'll go with you, haha. Let's go. Look, there's even like a reflection in the water. Isn't that crazy? It's kind of insane. I heard that the code for this game is not very efficient at all, but I mean, he popped off. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night. Knowing she was gonna beat me up, haha. -ha. Um, why are you coming with me? What's the tea? So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo! How cool would it be if Undyne came to a school? She could beat up all the teachers. Uh, I don't think that's how that works. <laughs> um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Well, I'm not innocent. I've killed. Whoa, this is cool. Damn it, am I supposed to get rid of the dog? Wait, how do I use the dog? Can I use the dog? Okay, let's get this artifact. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Take it. You're carrying too many dogs. <laughs> use the dog. You deployed the dog. The dog absorbs the artifact? Excuse me? The artifact is gone. Was I supposed to do that? <laughs> okay, we're back. Walking through the castle. Oh, you're just gonna run ahead like that? Why are you being weird? He's being weird. That was weird as heck. He's creepy. Take an umbrella, take one. You took an umbrella. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on your, my shoulders. Oh. Return the umbrella? Yeah. You return the umbrella. Wait, what's the significance of that? Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Oh, 
your poor face. Humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. Well, it got like brighter all of a sudden. In the end, it can hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken, take, taken? taken and countless monsters were turned to dust. Okay, let's save. The serene sound of a distant music box. It fills you with determination. All right, let's move ahead. We're walking, we're walking. Oh, the shadow thing makes me feel creepy. What are these things? Huh? No, 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 no
Inside are a couple of freeze-dried space food bars. Take one? No. It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. Huh? Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? No? You stare into each other's eyes for a moment. Oh, I don't like that. Don't tell me the dummy is the one. <gasps> what? Ha ha ha, too intimidated to fight me, huh? I'm a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy too, until you destroyed their home. Us ghosts spend our whole lives looking for a proper vessel. Slowly, slowly, we grow closer to our new bodies. Until one day, we too may become corp corporeal, corporeal, corporeal beings. Beings able to laugh, love, and dance like any other. But you! My cousin's future! You took it all- I'm sorry, bestie. I didn't know. Despicable, despicable, despicable! Human, I hope you're not too attached to your body. Because your soul's about to get evicted! Nah, bestie. I'm gonna destroy you. Mad, ew, mad dummy box the way. I don't like his face. Get him! Wait, is that it? Foolish, foolish, foolish. Even if you attack my vessel, you'll never hurt me. I'm still incorporeal, you dummy. Oh, shoot. Wait, is dummy a compliment? Oh, well, how was I supposed to know, huh? How was I supposed to know that? Ouch! Ow, you dummies. Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks. Dots. Hey, you! Forget I said anything about magic. Mad Dummy is looking nervous. Oh, okay, wait. Go back. Can I act? Wait, I can act and it's just Mad Dummy? Okay, we can fight. We can fight back. Futile, futile, futile! Let's just get them to come up. Yeah, attack him. Attack him! Mad Dummy is bossing around its bullets. But he still has full health. I'll defeat you and take your soul. Wait, what do I do with about the fact that he has still full health? Nice. <laughs> Mad Dummy glares into a mirror, then turns to you with the same expression. Am I supposed to continue to fight? Let's just act. Talk. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. No one is happy with this. I'll use your soul to cross the barrier. Wait, it didn't hit him that time! Mad Dummy glares at you into a mirror. Okay. I'll stand in this window of a fancy store. How do I get him to come get hit? Is that even doing anything? <laughs> Is it doing anything? No. Then everything I want will be mine. Why are you dancing, bestie? Mad Dummy is getting cotton all over the dialogue box? Is he actually getting hurt? Huh? Yeah, I guess that'll avenge my cousin. Wait, hit him, please! Okay, what was their name again? Excuse me, you don't even know your cousin's name. Mad Dummy is getting caught in all over. Whatever, whatever, whatever! Get him, get him, get him, get him! I think it's doing something, maybe? I'm actually not sure if this is doing anything. Pitiful, pitiful, pitiful! Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Can you hit him, please? Get him! 
Maybe it's not doing anything? Oh, why aren't you guys hitting him? Am I, like, debating myself into thinking that this is doing something? He keeps dodging it! Uh, can I act? Check. Add dummy attack, 30, defense, yes. Defense is just yes, because there are ghosts, physical attacks will fail. Pitiful, pitiful, pitiful. Get him, get him, get him, get him! Yeah, 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 yeah! Hey, guys! Oh, shit. Dummies, 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 dummies! Remember how I said not to shoot me? Well, failures! You're fired! You're all being replaced! Ha 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 ha! Now you'll see my true power! Relying on people that aren't garbage. Mechanical words fill the room. Dummy bots, magic missile. Oh, I gotta direct them towards him now. Try again. Oh shit. Oh frick. Okay. Go over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got this. I got it, I got it, I got it. I don't got it. I don't got it. I don't got it. Take him. <laughs> Come on, why is this so difficult? This is the longest fight we've had. Final attack. Please, go up to them. Go up to him! Ugh, no way. These guys are even worse than the other guys. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends. I've got knives! Wait, 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 wait hold up. I'm out of knives. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. You can't hurt me and I can't hurt you. You'll be stuck fighting me forever. 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 Ah ha 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 ha